back with some new products and it seems like everybody's releasing something right now and um, I've already done my Sephora haul and I had actually gone in before the actual um, <clears throat> sale took place because I knew I didn't have any points left or anything so I was just like yeah uh, it's not gonna save me enough to really 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 matter I mean not that every little bit doesn't matter but still I was just sort of like well um yeah it's not gonna it's not like I'm rich or anything so um actually today the new products that we're gonna be talking about are from Alta so uh, let me go over what I have on my face real quick and then we'll go ahead. Actually some of these are the newer products. So um, I have the Glow Oil SPF 50 and this one is by Super Goop. Um, the Super Stay C Plus and so that's what I have on as my base. I did go ahead and use the L'Oreal and LM as far as my concealer today. And then as far as the blush that I did, <clears throat> excuse me for a second, I went ahead and used the LYS. I have, let's see which one is, um, Curvy. So this is Curvy. And so that's what I actually have on my cheeks today. Let me go ahead and do just a little bit more. Oh yeah, and um, I actually, um, yeah, this uh, this makeup I was playing after I got the makeup and everything. So yeah, this is um, uh, I've done touch ups on this makeup. So um, like I said, this one is curvy, and so that's what I have on there. I do have uh, this highlighting palette on as well. And this one is Unusual Beauty. It's uh, one of the Timu highlighter palettes that you can go ahead and pick up if you're doing an order. And um, I went ahead and used this color as far as a highlighter. And I'm liking them because I think they're actually multi-chromes and that their formula is a lot like a multi-chrome shadow. So again, really enjoying these, very pretty. I haven't actually tried them as eyeshadows, but I probably will. And then as far as what I went ahead and used for my bronzer today, I'll butter up by NYX. I really do like these quite a lot. And so um, again, that's the bronzer that I have on. Um, let's see, as far as what I did for lips, that is only working so-so right now. Actually, let's come back to lips because, yeah. Um, I do have the Thick and Wow on as far as the brow. I did use the Panorama Mascara. Not a real big fan of this one. It just didn't really pack a punch for me at all. Um, what I did end up doing, and this is from what I just purchased, I got the new Essence Lash Without Limits. And so I went ahead and added this over the top of the Panorama. It worked out a lot better. Uh, the Essence runs at $4.99 and the Panorama runs at $12 or $13. Uh, this is a new one by Essence and I'm liking it a lot. And um, as far as what I did for the eyeshadow, I went ahead and used the Wildwood palette. This is by Alter Ego and this one actually is they're one of their new releases. They have two new releases out right now. And so I went ahead and used this in the crease, this right above the crease. Um, I did go ahead and use this on the lid and I combined it with this. Um, let's see, what else did I do here? Mm, is that all I did? Oh, no, I went ahead and I used another one of what I purchased and um, I'm playing a little late to the game on some of these, so I did go ahead and pick up the ColourPop uh, gel eyeliners, and I got a couple of the um, duochrome ones. I have uh, the green one on right now, and then I picked up the blue one as well, and I'll do a couple of swatches here real quick if I can get them open. So again, I have the Wildwood palette on, and then I did go ahead and use green from ColourPop. The green from ColourPop is a little bit more of a grassy green. 
Um, and then, let's see. If, oops. So there we go there. The tip just broke off there, but there's a swatch for you. I hate it when that happens. Okay. And then, um, yeah, like I said, I got two of the ColourPop eyeliners. So those are the two that I got. So it's the green right there and then the purple. And the purple is showing up more as a duochrome. The green, I think it is. I think it's a green and a light green or a green and a white. And so it just, it goes from light to lighter where the blue, since it's so dark, it goes blue to purple. So, and I do have a couple of other swatches on there. Sorry about that. Another new thing that I got that I've gone ahead and tried already is the Power Grip Dewy Setting Spray from e.l.f. And it is now over at Ulta, so you can pick it up there. It's probably everywhere else as well, but the only place I've seen it is Ulta. And then I'll go ahead and show you the rest of my haul here. And actually, it's good stuff. So, yeah. So right now, the only thing I have on the lips is the Hard Candy On Again and this pumping, Plumping Gloss. I went ahead and got three of the new NYX, and these are actually um, the Glitter, glitter Balm. <laughs> so uh, these are the Butter Glosses, but they're the Bling ones. And so I got these three colors. So far, um, let's go ahead and start with this one. So this is the gold one. Really pretty. And um, yeah, it's nice. Um, they definitely have glitter in them. But I want to go ahead and show you this one because this one kind of knocked my socks off. Yep, that's pretty. That's really pretty. So um, right now, over at Ulta, and again, we're in April of 2024, uh, they have the ColourPop buy one, get one half off. And so that's the sale that I got those on. And then another uh, NYX, they had um, buy two, get one free. So I did that as well. So those are what I did over there. Uh, the setting spray where did I put that oh it's right here okay setting spray from Alpha is running about 10 and um, got a couple of other products that are on sale now uh, this isn't one of their bigger sales but uh, I kind of like it so I got the peach slices snail rescue all in one so it's peach slices is the name of the company snail rescue all in one free moisturizer. So that's what I got there. And I got that one for daytime. And then, um, let's see, I was going ahead and watching Geek Out of Water, which is one of, um, it, she does a lot of foundation reviews and skincare and makes her own uh, skincare. And so it's always a um, channel that I always recommend. And so I got the number seven future renew night cream. So, uh, and it has, let's see, it's called powered by Peptycology. Peptycology. So, uh, this is a number seven products and they usually come up with formulas, um, that they only, that, you know, they only put in their products and they patent them and um, she was saying really good things about this and sort of working on fine lines and stuff and as we get older we all want to you know work on that and yes I take a retinol I, I don't take a um, I'm not on a prescription retinol um, but yeah I'd like to go ahead and add in s some other stuff and so I thought this would be a good one to try and it's new so yeah so um, I think that's my haul, and that's the result of my haul. And I will be cleaning this. Yeah, my desk has just sort of gone. Phew. There have been 